how to overcome negative thoughts. In this video, I'm going to teach you a simple, simple lessons on how to overcome negative thoughts so you can be more, so you can create more, so you can live life on your terms if that's what you want. Stay tuned. This is View. I'll see you on the other side. First of all, number one, we have to understand Freud's principle about negative thoughts and the fact that we tend to either do four things with negative thoughts. Number one, we tend to avoid. We avoid them completely. We avoid that they've even, you know, if we avoid places, we avoid experiences. If we've had a bad relationship, we avoid relationships. If we've had a bad experience starting a business, we tend to avoid it. Number two, we tend to deny, deny that we even have it deny that we've even experienced that negative thought. So we go from, you know, it wasn't us, it was you. It's a complete denial process. Number three, com compare. Now this is a powerful principle. If you say to someone, you know, you look like you've gained a little bit of weight and they say, well, you know, not compared to last year, I'm, I've, you know, I've, I've lost a lot from last year. And what that means is that rather than saying, you know, maybe I need to do a little bit more and they're experiencing a negative feeling maybe of anger or hurt, and rather than dealing with it, they compare it. And the fourth space is where we actually take a learning from it. So if you ever feel a negative thought or a negative, or someone says something and you feel some sort of what people perceive to be a negative thought, the key in all of this is to learn from it. What can you learn from it that will allow you to let go of that negative thought easily, effortlessly, and so that you can become more in the future? Because every single negative thought has an underlying message an underlying action, an underlying signal for us to do something about it. If you take fear, for example, if you're ever feeling fear, if you're ever feeling anxious or, or stressed, there's some sort of thing that ahead of schedule that you're worried about. And you know, worry is a subset of anxiety, which is similar to fear also. And so therefore, if you think of it on a rational, logical term like that, if I'm scared of something, what can I do to prepare myself for the future? I think a key area is to, to never make it wrong. So don't make it wrong for feeling a certain way. It's a, it's a natural part of life to have self-doubt, ha have thoughts. And so remember that, you know, we can't just have positive thoughts. That, that of course there's self-doubt, which, you know, link closely to our belief about ourselves and what we believe about others, etc. Again, which comes from our, our past, our background and our experiences. And so again, never make it wrong. Just start to understand how it feels, how it regnate, resonates and, you know, let's do something about it. So just a quick question. I'd love to know what's a negative thought you have. Write it in the comment below and let's have a chat about it sometime. What's a negative thought that you have so we can do something about it? What could you learn from that? Write some comments below. What could you learn from that negative thought that will allow you to be stronger for the future? What do you think the message is of that emotion? If you were to know what was the message, what would the message be under that negative thought? So quick summary, avoid. People tend to avoid, deny, compare or learn. So go with a space of learn. I promise you, you'll be very, very strong for it. As always, thank you for watching. My pleasure to connect with you. As always, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, comment below. I look forward to catching up with you soon. If you do want to be more, create more, live life on your terms, then this is for you. Subscribe, check out the content and I look forward to catching up. And if I do get a chance to meet you at a live event, I look forward to catching up with you and hearing how this information helps. Until next time, I'll see you soon.